Hey guys, what's up? So today we're showing you guys some more series shortcuts. So I'm Craig Goes iDevice Help Guys. This is actually his website, and I already did a video on this one, sleep mode. I have a separate video on that, but guys, I'll leave this link down in the description. And it's really simple. You guys do need iOS 12, and we'll need a shortcuts app installed, which is inside the App Store, and it's completely for free. But I'm gonna show you guys all these basic shortcuts. So they're all really cool, and they all have like their own purpose. I'll be showing you guys. So, like I said, I have all the links down in the description. You guys have to be in iOS 12 or higher. Guys, so, if you guys want one of these shortcuts, you literally just tap on Get Shortcut. It's going to open inside the app. You just tap on Get Shortcut again, and that's really it. It's that simple and that easy, guys. All right, so the first shortcut is always on display. So, yes, you can tap that and tap on the play. And basically, um, the display is always on for, like, a specific app. Second shortcut is called Calculator Tip. So, we can just tap on the three dots. You can tap on the play. And what is the bill so basically guys you just type in the bill so let's say i went somewhere by myself or something like that and um the bill costs like 5.58 i'm just you know five dollars 58 cents so uh 5.58 okay and how much you want to tip usually like you leave 20 percent tip let's say i want 18 percent tip and then it's going to do it for you. your tip is one dollar and your total is 6.58 so guys that's a really really cool one it makes like just um tipping really much easier all right guys and then that shortcut is called super control center tap on the three dots we can tap on play and basically it's gonna obviously just give you like a lot of stuff you can do um with the control center and these are all the stuff you guys can do with it calendar reminders control center five light music uh you stop check for update so just some cool stuff like that daily news weather calendar social media so i'm just gonna tap on that and then you guys It'll bring up another menu so now swiftly you could choose like your alarm your apple today bbc news check calendar social media and weather so say tap on weather i'm gonna type weather and you can tap on wherever one you want i'm just gonna tap on forecast and then it's um you know there's a lot of stuff that comes up um let's say there um current location and it's gonna give me the weather for where i am all right guys and that shortcut is called send delay tets and this one's pretty cool so we're gonna tap on play and basically, we're going to text somebody, and then we actually got to, I guess, change the time to when they're actually going to receive the message. All right, so I'm just going to text myself. I tapped on myself's name. What we like to say, I'm going to say hi, tap on OK, and then you literally set the time for a message. So like, let's say it's someone's birthday, or, you know, let's say it's a special day, like your parents' anniversary, or whatever day is. The day is, you guys, you could just text them, say happy birthday, and then put their, like, the day of their birthday in here, and automatically text them. So that's, you know... You know, you can't really get in trouble for saying not saying happy birthday because a lot of people take offense to that because you don't remember their birthday or whatever day. This makes it a lot more easier. And, like, let's say you have something to say to them, but, like, later. So, let's say you won't want to hang out with them, but you want to hang out with them at the school and, like, you're on your mind. You know, you can just, like, send a message and then put the time for a lock or whatever you want to put it for. But you set the time and you tap on OK. And then it's going to actually send the message. So, that's pretty cool. We also have super low power mode. So, this one's super low power mode. Um, I guess it's just like it's like low power mode, but also like it like it turns off your I guess your Bluetooth or whatever. Uh, your brightness goes all the way down. It turns on low power mode. Your silly dad. So it's just kind of like puts like a lot of things on at one time. I mean a lot of things off, and it saves you battery. Like just it takes like everything off because like low power mode saves a lot of battery, but this is just some of the um, extra features. It it turns off like your Wi-Fi, your um you know your Bluetooth, your brightness all the way down. This saves you more battery. Last but not least, guys, it's called Find Gas Nearby tap on the three dots tap on the play it's going to search for a gas station that is nearby you all right guys so now it actually loaded up for me and these are all the places i get my gas so it shows you how far it is from me and the name of the place so if i want to go to wawa get my gas i'll just tap on wawa it's going to be in my maps it's going to show you the location and show you i guess like how to get there and stuff like that so it's pretty cool guys make sure you guys check out these shortcuts like i said i'll link down below these are all the shortcuts i showed you guys in the video so you guys thank you so much for watching and check out iDevice's channel or iDevice Hub's channel i'll link for his channel down in the description so you guys peace out bye